Hello and welcome to Nana's Crafty Home. Today's tutorial is going to show you how to do a foundation half double crochet. Uh, this is going to build on the foundation single crochet that I have also done a tutorial for. Uh, so if you have done that foundation single crochet, you will find this uh, to be an easy build on that. Uh, however, if this is your first uh, time doing any kind of foundation row. Um, I'm going to make it as simple as I can for you. So uh, simply uh, attach your yarn here and uh, what you're going to do is you're going to start with a chain three. One, two, and three. So what you're going to do to start your first stitch is you're going to, as if you were doing a half double, you're going to yarn over and you're going to insert your hook in that third chain from the hook. So then we will yarn over and pull up a loop. This loop that I've just pulled up is going to be used as my uh, chain, uh, what I will work my next uh, half double crochet into. So we will keep track of that, but then we will yarn over pull up another loop, grab that loop because that is what we're going to work our next half double crochet into, yarn over and just as you would half double, pull through all three loops on your hook. So as you can see here, I've made my first complete half double crochet. I've grabbed onto that loop that I'm going to work my next half double into and I'm going to do the same thing I just did yarn over, insert my hook into that loop, yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull up a loop. Now remember that is going to be my next chain. I'm going to grab onto that, yarn over, pull through all three loops. I've now completed two half double crochets. You can, as I am here, kind of grab that loop uh, to kind of guide your work and help you uh, remember where you're supposed to go the next time. If you're just starting out and this is all new to you and you're a little unsure, you can also move a stitch marker. Put a stitch marker in there as you're making that loop uh, so that you don't get confused. Uh, but as you can see here, I'm simply just grabbing it and using it to hold on to my work. So yarn over insert my hook into that loop, yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through, yarn over, pull through all three loops. And I'm going to continue this for however many my pattern calls for. This is a great uh, foundation for any project that you want a little bit more give. So for example, I use this a lot for hats because um, you know sometimes you just really don't want the brim of that hat to be too tight. You want a little bit of give and this has some stretch to it. As you can see here, there's quite a bit of give. Uh, but of course you can use this for any, uh, if you'd prefer to use this over um, the chain and then the half double into the chain, you could do it for any project. So just continue on. Okay. So uh, you see here I have several and to count those one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So I've completed ten foundation half double crochets and um, of course if this were um, you know something a project that you were just working in rows you would turn your work uh, at the beginning of your next and you would work your uh, rows just the same as you would with any half double crochet row. 
So there you have it, the foundation half double crochet. I hope this was helpful for you. Please visit me on my Facebook page. I am on Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, and of course, nanascraftyhome.com. You can send me an email if you wish. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I hope you all have a great day and see you soon. Thanks. Bye-bye.